excuse the hair, guys. I was on my spin bike and I sweated up a storm, and yeah, now it's back to the curls. Anyway, this is crazy. So this isn't really a re it's it's a half reaction, but it's also more of a discussion because I watched part of it and I'm like, this has to be spoken of. This has to be talked about. The mark of the beast. It's freaking here, basically. Let's check this out. This is Zoe. Just like you, she uses lots of different cards and IDs to get through her day. What if all Zoe needed was herself? Introducing Amazon One, a free service that lets you- Amazon One. That's the issue. Don't love any inanimate object or company. Because that's idolizing things that don't matter. Anyway, I gotta get back to this video. You use your palm to quickly pay for things. Gain a okay, palm to pay for things. Palm to pay for things. Did you hear that? Palm to pay for things. Access, earn rewards, and more. A star's reward. Pentagram. Let's look at the symbolism right here. Nothing yet, that I know of at least. Well, as far as from this specific still image right here. Let's say you're grabbing... So right there, <clears throat> scan your hand. Your favorite coffee beverage. Or heading into the office. Or, or checking out. Just hover your palm and you're on your way. It's as easy as that. Sign up is free and takes less than a minute. Sign up is free. Because it's not forced. They're not going to have you pay for something. Although your soul is the cost. All you need is a credit card, your phone number, and your palm. The number of his name. That's it. And your palm. Since your palm is unique and can't be... There it is. So you got the spider right there. The black and white. Duality. And the lightning bolt. <clears throat> and the devil horns, right there. The green wristband, showing your allegiance, that you're marked. The two rings. And can't be lost or misplaced. Hmm. Right there too. Some people do not have hands. Yeah, that's like a, that's a 7200. On some type of cannon. Excuse the green screen. This is a cool, this is a preacher right here. He actually preaches just like that. Yeah, so how is he going to pay if he don't have hands, right? Oh, we'll just put it on his forehead. You can get things done quickly and securely. And with more experiences on the way, Right Amazon ahead. One will help you get even more done, simply by being you. Now, Zoe has more time to do what she loves, indoor skydiving. Enter the Infinity logo right there. Identify and pay. Enter, identify and pay. Enter, identify and pay. Enter, identify and pay with Amazon One. The Devil's Tale. Well, hey there, Zoe. I got a question. What if I don't have hands? I hear you there, street preacher. I hear you loud and clear. Well, if you don't have hands, you got a forehead, don't you? We've got you covered. Das kommende Jahrzehnt muss Europas Digital Decade sein. Und wir brauchen einen gemeinsamen Plan für das digitale Europa mit ganz klar definierten Zielen bis 2050. Wir brauchen Ziele bis 2030, unter anderem in den Feldern Konnektivität, digitale Kompetenzen, öffentliche Verwaltung und vieles anderes mehr. And he caused all.
both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads, and that no man might buy or sell save he that had the mark or the name of the beast or the number of his name. It's coming, people. It's coming. Start reading. Start reading. Okay. Start reading it, people. Come on. In fact, one of my most viewed videos is... Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. The Mark of the Beast. Okay, it doesn't want to show up right there. That's fine. Here it is. I can't believe he just paid with his hand. Like, you just literally put your hand up, I s and you're good to go. Like, that's crazy. Uh, the latest breakthroughs. Turns out, one of the biggest discoveries is actually this tiny. See how small that is? This little chip may be the next big thing, and it sounds like it's right from a sci-fi movie, but people all over the world are implanting these into their wrists. Uh, the ultimate goal that these people have in mind is the goal to um, create a one-world government run by the banking industry, run by the bankers, where, and, and they're doing it in sections, the chip implant. Kinds of new ways to safeguard and identify all those things that make each of us unique, our faces, even our fingerprints, even our eyes. Here now with more on the future of technology. A biometric reality today. And you have nothing. You can't buy food. You can't do anything. It's total control of the people. And that chip's connected to a database that has your purchasing records, what you do, what everything, you sell. Everything is in there, you know? And so they, they want a one world government controlled by them, everybody being chipped. To make purchases, 75% of the population still would need to accept it, unless government forced a cashless system like we're seeing in Denmark. Will you oh, a cashless system? You mean Corona? Where people can't really do much? This is it. Think about it. When I see a cashless society in our lifetimes, well, if Bill Gates and Visa have their way, the next time you leave a grocery store, they may just hand you a receipt. Unless, of course, you don't receive the mark. What do you think about these developments? Comment below with your thoughts and hit that share button. The feet of a bear. The beast was allowed to brag, who claimed to be God, and for 42 months, it was allowed to rule. The beast cursed God, and it cursed the name of God even curse the place where God lives, as well as everyone who lives in heaven with God. It was allowed to fight against God's people and defeat them. It was also given authority over the people of every tribe, nation, language, and race. The beast was worshipped by everyone whose name wasn't written before the time of creation in the Book of the Lamb who was killed. If you have ears, then listen. If you are doomed to be captured, you will be captured. If you are doomed to be killed by a sword, you will be killed by a sword. This means that God's people must learn to endure, be faithful. I now saw another beast. This one came out of the ground. It had two horns like a lamb, but spoke like a dragon. It worked for the beast whose fatal wound had been healed. And it used all its authority to force the earth and its people to worship that beast. It did not die after being wounded by a sword. It was allowed to put breath into the island so that it could speak. Everyone who refused to worship the idol of the beast was put to death. All people were forced to put a mark on their right hand or forehead. Whether they were powerful or weak, rich or poor, free people or slaves, they all had to have this mark, or else they could not buy or sell anything. This mark stood for the name of the beast and for the number of its name. You need wisdom to understand the number of the beast. But if you are smart enough, you can figure this out. Its number is 666, and it stands for a person. <laughs> Forgot I put Trump there. But still, he's doing it, so whatever. Remember, Trump did say it's not over, right?
Hillary Clinton. It's all politics. All freaking politics. And I'll leave you guys with this. Sell your soul and worship the digital age. It's coming. It's coming. Um, yeah. Pretty much it. Believe it or not, it's coming. And as always, may the Lord Jesus Christ bless you. Have a good day. Stay safe and do not take the mark. Peace.